So this is going to be quite a short tutorial on um, how to, or just more more polyfit um, practice. So basically, if we have an equation like this, we've got Celsius equals a, which is some variable times Fahrenheit plus b, and then, and we're also given Celsius equals zero when Fahrenheit equals thirty two, and also also um, Celsius equals one hundred when Fahrenheit equals two one two. So obviously we could put them in to work it out, but we're going to use our polyfit function to uh, do this. So first of all, you can see right here that there's a linear um, relationship between the two. So we can straight away write, um, I'm going to write C as in Celsius equals, and then we're going to write our value, so that's 0, and then our other value is 32. Yeah, so then our Fahrenheit we're going to call F equals, um, no, sorry, that was wrong. C, it's going to be 0 and 100 because it's just the two values of Celsius. And then F equals um, 32 and 212. Okay, so now if you remember from our poly um, fit function, we write P, which is like the poly. Uh, polynomial coefficients equals polyfit and then we put our x values in so that's going to be um, since in this equation if we have in the in the form y equals mx plus b we're going to say Celsius is going to be y and Fahrenheit's going to be um, x so we're going to write Fahrenheit Celsius is going to be y and then since we know that's in this form we know it's going to be a linear fit so n the highest